Hey, good morning, y'all. This is Captain Miles with Tradition Fishing Charters. I uh, just wanted to let y'all know that Trigger Fish is open this weekend. And, um, you know, a lot of people talk about how hard they are to clean and, and all that stuff. Well, let me tell you, it's, it's not real hard. It just takes a couple little things you want to do different. Uh, so, if you're fortunate enough to get out there and catch a few this weekend, uh, my sister-in-law, TC, up at Perdido Bay Seafood, um, she put together a couple nice videos uh, to help y'all out. One showing you how to fillet it, the other one showing you how to get the throats out, which is a delicious piece of meat that a lot of people throw away. Uh, so anyway, um, I'm gonna share that with y'all. Uh, Captain Willie's got a trip tomorrow. Hopefully he'll get a few and we'll share some pictures with y'all. Um, look, if you wanna go fishing, just give us a call at 850-324-4464. And if you need any uh, seafood to go with any of your meals, you can check out the Family Fish Market at Perdido Bay Seafood. Their number is 492-0455, located under the bridge of Perdido Key. That's also where we're uh, fortunate enough to run our charters out of. So. Anyway, hope you enjoy. Thanks. All right. Here's your trigger fish. There's a big monster. Vampire teeth, get in there. Ah! <laughs> anyway, when he sleeps that night, he bites onto something, he locks this bad boy out right here. No matter how hard you push, it won't go in. Here's the little baby trigger. You push that, and it slides right down. And that's all. So when somebody tries to eat him while he's sleeping, he'll lock this out. And if they try to bite them from the back, this gets stuck in their throat and they spit them out. Dun dun dun! Alright, don't forget that. It's gonna be a test later. Now they gotta hide on them. No scales, just like alligator skin. So when you cut them, you cut them from the inside out. You start right here in this little soft spot behind their skull right here. Where you can see it push in. Put your knife upside down. Push in, and you go straight in. All the way back to his butthole. Come out and pull it up like that. Now you're in. So now you put your knife in here and cut from the inside out again, all the way down. Pull them up. Bring his little tail off of there. And that's it. And once you got it off, you can just pull his meat off the skin like that. So you got something to hang on to. And then you skin him like this. There's your trigger fillet. Cut the bones out. Little pin bones, about six or seven of them right here. And they go up towards the dorsal side. So you lean your knife back. Cut that bad boy out. Now you're skinless and boneless, ready to go. Both sides you trigger fish fillet. You can cut out his throat here. What you want to do is set his backbone down flat. Turn his head up there at a 90 degree angle. Correct that backbone so he's standing just like that. And right here in that little meaty part of his chin where it's all gushy and soft, Take one of these big old serrated knives and just start sawing. And you're going to go all the way back down here to the hinge of his jaw and curve around. So you got to cut like that. Once you got to cut like that, you just break it in half. And all you've got attached is these guts or whatever the hell that stuff is. Just chop that off. Free it up. For Christ's sake, in a second. Oh! Watch out for that. Oh. So then you've got his throat here. And inside there's this little bone here. So what you're going to do is hold him up like this. And you're going to take just a regular knife, cut on each side of that so that it lays down flat. Now 
free it up from this bone here on both sides. And then just grab a hold of it and skin this side of the throat. These little kill things off if they're on there. And that's your throat. It's kind of like chicken thigh. Same bone structure and everything. You can batter that up and fry it or throw them on the grill. Whatever you want to do. That's it. And it's delicious. If you didn't cut those out, you'd be wasting, what, a little over a pound worth of meat? Anyway, have a good day.